South Korea's national security adviser will travel to the U.S. early next week to discuss bilateral security cooperation plans. All eyes are on how Kim Guan Jin's meetings with his American counterpart Susan Rice and other high-ranking officials will pan out, especially with North Korea's foreign minister due in the U.S. in the coming days. Our Sun Jung-in has this report. President Park's national security adviser Kim Guan Jin will embark on a three-day trip to the U.S. on Sunday in what will be his first trip to the country since he took up his new role in June. Sources say Kim is scheduled to meet his American counterpart Susan Rice and other security-related personnel to discuss a broad range of issues, including the Korea-U.S. alliance and the current diplomatic and security situation in Northeast Asia. In particular, the talks will likely center on Pyongyang's rapidly changing diplomatic stance following its decision to send its foreign minister Lee Su-yong to a meeting of the UN General Assembly later this month. This will mark the first visit to the U.S. by a North Korean foreign minister in 15 years. During Kim's visit, the U.S. and South Korea will likely reaffirm their bilateral cooperation in dealing with the North's nuclear program and fine-tune details in strengthening security cooperation. Also, a military issue's attention is being drawn on how the talks will pan out regarding Washington's plan to deploy an advanced missile defense system called Terminal High Altitude Area Defense in South Korea. With the recent launch of a unification preparatory committee and Seoul's proposal of high-level inter-Korean talks, Kim may also seek some advice regarding exchanges and cooperation measures during the anticipated talks. Son Jung-in, Arirang News.